Hi, this is Igor from hdhead.com. I will show you how easy it is to do paint fixes in Resolve 15 with this new inclusion of Fusion. Here on the Resolve timeline, we have this handheld clip of a school bus. And let's say we want to take out this bus manufacturer logo that's on the side of the bus. We'll go to Fusion. I will customize the viewer a little bit because we don't need both of these viewer panes. We'll click here and zoom in so we can see the logo better. With media in selected, press control space to call up the tool menu and type in paint, press OK. That adds the paint node, which we can send to our viewer by pressing 2 on the keyboard. And now we can paint. I will select the stroke tool. Go to brush controls, make the brush size a little smaller, and under apply mode, we'll select the clone mode. Now find out what area you want to clone from. Press and hold Alt key, click and drag, and release the Alt key, and start painting. I will paint all this in a single stroke. Uh, you can do a multi-stroke and group those as well. I see a little bit of residue of the logo, but it's fine for our purpose. Click on the Select tool, drag over this stroke to select it, and go over to the right, under Stroke Controls, Center, right-click and select Modify with Tracker Position. This places a tracker onto the screen. If we click here on Modifiers, double-click the track, these are the controls for the tracker that we just placed there. We have to tell it what the source is. So I'm going to click and drag the media in node and drop it here. Look on the track label to see our target area. We'll track forward. It was a very quick track. Push play. And the logo is gone. Go back to the edit page and it's gone on the edit page as well. Hey, I hope you found this tutorial on Resolve Paint helpful. When you have time, make sure to check out hdhead.com for some helpful Resolve online tools.